happening now. Family and friends gathering at a Sheboygan church for a memorial service for three children killed in a house fire last week. The tragedy taking a toll on an entire community. NBC 26's Raquel Amel joins us live as hundreds come to pay their respects. Well, Stacy, visitation is still going on here for about another half hour, and then that memorial service will start at 6.30. But the people I spoke with say they are remembering these three children who've left an impact on their community. Gone but not forgotten. This community will never be the same because of this, you know, and, and, and it hurts now but it's, it's bringing our community together. Hundreds of people heading to Southside Alliance Church to say goodbye one last time to three children who've touched their lives. She was one of those girls that ran up to me and was like, hey, what's your name? You're gonna be my leader, and she was so excited. Caitlin Murphy ran church group for 11-year-old Natalie Martin. She says she would talk about her brothers and family often and always had a smile. Being a parent, I can't imagine that kind of hurt, but there is a lot of hope. And that message of hope is what Pastor Jeff Jagger is trying to share with the community through this tragedy. When it comes to things like this tonight, tragedies like what have gone on, the reality is sometimes there are questions that just don't have easy answers, and this is one of them. Remembering and coming together, a community forever changed by a tragedy bringing them all closer. Now, I'm told there are hundreds of letters inside written by community members and children. Those letters will be put together into a book and given to the Mackey family. Live in Sheboygan, Raquel Amell, NBC 26.